Are you ready to play ouch my niece because I'm a 39 year old dad making a video in his garage and it really hurt when I jumped up like that? Me too. So I have approximately six minutes to play the celebrity name antonym game, but we also mustn't forget. Becky. We're still doing your list, but first, let's do a celebrity. Now, someone who's probably not a Pratt, <laughs> but is named Chris Pratt. The opposite of Chris Pratt is... <laughs> Wet fluffy fish. <laughs> I'll explain, it makes perfect sense. So we've got crisp rat, a crisp rat. And the opposite of crisp is wet and floppy, and the opposite of a rat is a fish. <laughs> yes. On my knees. Navy foot. Will I be editing this video? Probably I don't have enough time to do that. So you just enjoy the, the vibes. Enjoy the milieu. Enjoy the ambience. Not the ambient. <laughs> That's another enjoyment. Anyway, the next one on your list, Becky, is Kingston Messiah Anderson. Kingston, Messiah, and a son. <laughs> Sorry. <clears throat> so the opposite of king is queen. Then we have ton. The opposite of a ton is the negative ton. Has a buoyancy of one ton, which is the opposite of one ton. <laughs> a mess. The opposite of a mess is, of course, clean. No. I don't know if the word cleanness has two ends or one, so we're just going to go with it. The opposite of I is you. The opposite of ah is ah. Oh. I can't believe this has got three layers. It's a good antonym name, this one. The opposite of and is or, sort of, sort of. Maybe it would be and not, but we're gonna go with or because sometimes I like rowing. But first. It's still quite hot in here. <laughs> the opposite of er uh is to not make a mistake. And the opposite of a son is a mother, I think, because it's the opposite of the son and the son is the other, the other. Mm -hmm. I we made it the four, four layers. Kingston, you're so lucky. I think this is the first four layer antonym name we've ever had here at Eight Elbows Adventures. What did I say? Oh, mother. So Kingston, Messiah Anderson, the opposite of your name is Queen, buoyancy of one ton, cleanness, you are. Or not make a mistake, mother. Whoa, that's a really good one. I like that one. Let's do the next one. I just need to just cross it off the list. I'm gonna have to edit some of this video. Then we have Ezekiel Munro Anderson, the coel bird left. That's lovely. The garbage truck has now entered the building, not the building, entered the street and is picking up the garbage. I'm going to hide just here so that they can't see me. I'm not easily embarrassed. Now, the next one on your list, 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 list Becky. <laughs> the next one on your list, Becky, is Ezekiel Munro Anderson. Now, this is a good one. So the opposite of easy is hard. Eek, Ezekiel, eek. The opposite of eek is, hmm. <laughs> um, the opposite of an eel is a snake, because the snake is like an eel, but dry, mostly. The opposite of mon is chew, because Monday is Monday and chew is Tuesday, the second day of the week. The opposite of ro, which is fish eggs, the opposite of ro, which is fish eggs, is of course rat babies. <laughs> See what I did there? And then of course we come to the surname, Anderson. So the opposite of Anne is Andrew. Then we've got duh, and then th not so obvious. Because the opposite of duh is not so obvious. Mm -hmm. And then on is off. So therefore, Ezekiel Munro Anderson, the opposite of your name is hard, hmm, snake chew, rat babies, Andrew, not so obvious, off. That's fantastic, but that's enough. That that is enough. That's enough. Whew. If you enjoyed that video, um, surprise us on Patreon by giving us a follow, a like for free if you want on the Patreons. But if you join up, then sometimes we put extra updates for the Patreons. Oh, we forgot the traditional popcorn hat and disco. Thank you so much for breathing, and remember, be kind, be curious, and stay awesome. And come back for more silliness later on like every weekday for the next two and a half years. Maybe one and a half years.
a long time, but I believe in you. There's a really annoying bird. Can you hear it? Oh, it stopped. Maybe I answered it. I think it's called a coel. The first coel was really quite bad. It repeated itself over and over. Made me mad.